I haven't talked to Juice in a couple days. I'm about to call this nigga right now. See what the fuck he's been up to. It better not be in his feelings. I'm going to go over there and smack him. Get out your feelings, boy. Got the keys to my new crib. Juice! What the what the fuck you been up to? With your with your chick. Right now? No, I'm about to go to the store right now. Oh. Shit. Don't fuck home. Is we live in boring ass, fucked up ass Michigan. Ain't shit to do here, so that's the only thing to do is yeah, go to work, go home. Exactly. <laughs> For real, shit. Nah, if I was in Vegas or California, oh my gosh. <laughs> Much more to do her. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to catch me. <laughs> Ain't so much shit to do out there, you wouldn't be able to catch me. I already know. <laughs> shit. I already know. It's a lot of shit out there. Man. But out here, I yeah, there ain't much to do. Yeah, out here is dead. Only thing I hear to do is that get shot or killed. <laughs> Shit, that's the only thing. Shit, man. Yeah, it's stupid shit. My motherfucking brother, um, that nigga, uh, he gonna be in the hospital for another two weeks, and then he gotta be in rehab for two months. And he gonna go back to uh, North Carolina with his mama. Hell yeah. Fuck, what's the grade with he had to get? Uh, Memphis, Tennessee. Oh, yeah. Fuck, what you doing over there? <laughs> Shit, <laughs> that's what we all was like. What is he even doing there? Like, why he picked there to go? Like, what? <laughs> Joe just be going. <laughs> be a cancer, just like me. He just be going. And they, uh, they said, cause it ain't, it ain't, them niggas wasn't even at the, at the co-worker. They was at the co-worker's son. Cause you know, he was helping his co-worker move and shit. So it was right. the co-worker, his bitch, the grandkids, his son, and his son girl, and then Joe. They all was out there and shit. So the, the grandson went around the corner. I mean, the son went around the corner to the gas station and shit. I guess he got into it with some niggas at the gas station. They followed his silly ass back to the motherfucking house. And that's when they just got to shooting and shit. And still, why Joe was the only one that got hit? I don't know. Maybe I don't know what the fuck the son looked like or none of that shit. Maybe he light-skinned. He looked just like Joe or some shit. I don't know. But Joe's the only one that got hit. No, yeah, Joe definitely was, but shit. Yeah. Everybody thought it was just the, the co-worker that he was helping moving and shit. They thought it was his beef. Some niggas was after him and shit. But <clears throat> it wasn't even that. It was his motherfucking son going up to the gas station running his fucking mouth. I thought be talking about people like, y'all let him shut the fuck up. Shit. Just shut the fuck up. God damn. Right. His son. Just running his motherfucking mouth and shit. Uh, I, don't, I don't know, man. Uh, I don't know. He all right, shit. He hitting a lot of pain. That nigga angry, cussing out everybody at the hospital and shit. 
I'm like, yeah, y'all just... They trying to just get him to move around and shit, because, you know, they can't let him go home. He can't go home without peeing. And shit. I think, um... I think in six months, he's supposed to go back and have another surgery so they can get that bag off of him. But right now, that nigga just in a lot of pain. He angry. You know, the detectives came in and asked him if he knew anything, if he remember anything. Of course, he said no. And whatnot. So, I left the detectives, like, you know, only... The detectives said they was going to the motherfucking gas station to get the surveillance camera from the gas station and shit like that because... See, me and Donovan, we feel better because it was literally somebody there at the house that was actually thumping back at them niggas. I missed that part, my bad. It was actually somebody was at the house that was thumping back at the motherfuckers that was doing the drive-by and shit. So, me and Donovan was happy that, okay, at least somebody was there trying to get active and shit, you feel me? Trying to get active back with them niggas and shit. You feel me? So, we was happy about that part or whatnot. So, they asking the son, they was like... So, uh, when they came around and they started shooting, did you start shooting back? And, you know, everybody said, no, nah, and shit, like, no, nah, because they found a whole bunch of motherfucking shell cases and shit on the ground around the house and shit like that. So, that, that means somebody at the house was shooting back, you feel me? But, you know, everybody like, no, nah, no, nah. when nobody shooting back at them, we all just started running. And then they, they and then they was, they, they left it at that, so the detectives said, told, uh, uh, Stacy, like, yeah, we just gonna go to the, um, to the gas station to get the surveillance cameras from the gas station to see what happened, what all happened at the gas station, and shit like that or whatnot, so. Right. So, basically, somebody trying to blow back at the niggas, basically. Yeah, it was either, that, Don, like, that was, that was the co-worker's son. Like, it was that nigga that was thumping back. But, I mean, the detectives came and asked you, was you shooting back? I'm going to say no, too. You feel me? Like, no, nah, I wasn't shooting, especially if that gun ain't registered to me and none of that shit. And I'm going to say no. I know. Shit. Yeah. Well, they went up there and asked Joe. Joe said he don't remember nothing. Basically, he gonna be in the, in the hospital for a little bit more. Then, now, Joe gonna be in the hospital for two weeks, and then he going to rehab for um, two months. In July, he should be able to get a uh, leave rehab facility and go uh, to North Carolina with his mama. Basically, uh, after, uh, after six months, he gotta go back to Tennessee to get another surgery done to remove that shit bag and so they can put all his organs and shit back in them right. So that's really okay looking at a year's recovery. I didn't call her yesterday to check on him. I'm gonna call later around the night. brother over in New York. I haven't talked to this nigga. He a funny motherfucker. That's what you ain't gonna never grow up, are you? You yeah. say he is New York. Look at my other little brother. My trophy. Yeah, well, he in Buffalo. That little nigga funny as hell. Well, I still gotta be out there. That's the only that Cali, yeah, or Vegas. I'm the only three. I ain't been to yet. What, Buffalo? Uh, New York. I ain't been there yet either. Uh, uh, Cali or Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I said, took Dante, he knocking niggas out down there and shit. I'm not taking Dante nowhere else with his embarrassing ass. He's embarrassing. I hate old embarrassing ass motherfuckers like Nia. She's embarrassing. Just by the way she acting, and let people play her and shit like that. Like, and I'm, you mad at me because I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to school you. I'm trying to open your eyes up to the bullshit. And you want to be mad at me and shit. Like, you a stupid ass bitch. Dante a stupid ass motherfucker. I'm not taking that embarrassing ass nigga nowhere else. Oh, embarrassing ghetto ass nigga. I seen Ramsey last night too. 
Oh, embarrassing ass oh, nigga. That nigga don't know. And he thought I was about to take him to New York with me. Bitch, I'm about to take you nowhere else. Stop telling people you're going to New York with me because you're not. Oh, embarrassing <laughs> ass nigga. You know how to fucking act, man. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> That nigga always for the fight and shit, man. Man, fuck all the fighting shit. That ain't shit. I fight too. That ain't shit. You at least embarrassing. Like you nigga, you jumping out the fucking window. Got to. And then you at my motherfucking parents' house out there, nigga. You can't keep your motherfucking area clean. You got your shoes laying all around the fucking kitchen and shit. You got tobacco and shit all on the goddamn kitchen counter and shit. Motherfucking swishing papers and shit. Bitch, you're fucking embarrassing. That's why your daddy locked your ass in the motherfucking basement. Don't let you use the rest of the motherfucking house like a normal motherfucking person because you don't know how to motherfucking act. Bitch, pick pick up behind yourself. Ain't nobody your motherfucking made up in this bitch, nigga. How the fuck? We both. I got this nigga hooked up. He got 15000 and shit. I, I put the same play down for me. I got me 15000 and shit, right? All right, this nigga blew his whole 15000 on two bitches in Vegas. Dumb as hell. Fifteen fast. Nigga retarded. What? <laughs> I was coming it. back with with probably majority or more than shit. It's supposed and to I be more, there. more. <laughs> I yeah. came back with more. <laughs> <laughs> I came back with thirty five thousand. Like wow, what happened to you? You mean to tell me you blew all your money on it? You a dumb motherfucker. Yes, uh-huh. This nigga blew 15k. How the fuck? <laughs> what? Bro, he's embarrassing. 15k, though, nigga? Bro, that nigga's embarrassing. Nigga blew 15k, though. That's crazy. And then was looking dumb as hell. That rain him. He was looking dumb as hell. On the way back home. After he got done jumping out this bitch window. Look at that. <laughs> 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 that nigga didn't that nigga didn't say nothing to me the whole the whole motherfucking ride back to Michigan. He didn't say shit to me. Cause he already knew I was gonna let his stupid ass have it. Say a motherfucking word to me. Say something what ignorant out your say? motherfucking mouth. Right, what could he say? Hey, shit, the nigga could say shit. You fucked up. You jumping out of where bitches quit those. So clearly you wasn't supposed to be there. It, thank you, that part. He talking about shit. Uh, I would I just didn't <laughs> want to wake up her people. Excuse me? Nigga, I would have woke all them uh, bitches up because the same way I got up in this motherfucker is the same way I'm leaving this bitch. Not about to be jumping out right. no motherfucking window. You are. They already look at motherfuckers as black people as a fucking monkey. You want to go jump out the fucking window? You embarrassing. The fuck yeah, is wrong with you? Nigga, I, I want to talk. Told I, like, I, look. Right. I told her, I was like, bitch, I'm walking through the door. Man, man you I'm not feel me? No fucking not about to jump out the Man, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? Bitch, you got me fucked up. I don't give a fuck about you or the boat. And the, and the motherfuckers that rode in on this boat with you, bitch. I'm leaving at this motherfucking door. Bitch, I don't know what the fuck you thought this was. <laughs> this nigga jumping out the motherfucking window. He's so embarrassing. Jumped out the window. Y'all niggas was home <laughs> with him when we got back. Oh, my God. <laughs> y'all was letting that nigga... Y'all couldn't wait till we got back, huh? Because y'all niggas went in on his stupid ass. And he thought this shit was. Because you goofy, bro. Because you goofy. Because you goofy as hell, bro. Ah, this nigga. Y'all is dumb. Y'all could not wait. Oh, my God. Macy was texting this nigga on the road. She's sending me everything. She didn't text this nigga. He was saying shit to me. He already knew. I was about to let him have it. That's why I'm looking like I don't know why he was around this bitch telling people. Because this nigga Pops called us. Came up to the watch talking about shit. Yo, you heard from my son? And da, da, da. I'm like, no, nah, what happened? And he swear up and down. <laughs> his daddy about, don't care about him. He talk about you. You couldn't find him. 
I couldn't. I'm like, I'm like, shit, just give him a minute. He'll probably, he'll probably no, call. No, you know what? Over. You know what? Because I had remembered that he had shared his location with me one day because he, um, his phone was about to die. And, um, he had got lost or some shit, just walking and shit. So I'm like, all right. He didn't know he, that's why he shared his location. So I had to remember that I got this nigga location. And I pulled right the fuck up. It's seven something in the fucking morning and shit. You got me going to these people's houses and shit. I don't even know who the fuck this is. Like, what? We never met the bitch or none of that shit. Like, bro, if you don't bring your stupid dead when I get out there, he, they peeking out the window and I can see them peeking out the window and shit. I'm like, they peeking out there because I was on the phone with Macy. I'm like, they peeking out the window. Like, what the fuck, bro? He gonna turn his location <laughs> off and shit. I said, oh, so now he turns his location off. And so Ramsey had called me. So I picked up the phone. I'm, he was like, you fine? I said, yeah. I said, I had his location. I forgot I had his location. I said, but his dumb ass sitting here peeking out the motherfucking window. Like, I don't see them peeking out the window and shit. I said, he just turned off his location. He like, what is he on? Ramsey was mad as hell. Like, the fuck, nigga? What is you doing, nigga? Yeah. Ramsey had to hold that nigga, too. Like, you was jumping out the window. He was like, and you blew 15 on this bitch? A whole fifteen thousand, not fifteen, not fifteen hundred. You spent fifteen thousand. You blew, you blew fifteen thousand. Ramsey, like, who the fuck do you think you are? Like, who do you think you are? Like, who? What? <laughs> like, nigga, you not the man. Like, you, why would you blow fifteen thousand? Fifteen grand, like you just wiped your ass with that. Right. <laughs> no, like Ramsey said, like. Nigga, did you go to Floyd Mayweather's uh strip club and, and blew fifteen thousand on 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 fifteen twenty bitches? No, you did not. You blew you blew fifteen thousand on two bitches that that you would never ever see or speak to ever again. Because when he got back, that bitch hold his ass. She blocked that nigga and everything. Like right. And he talked about, oh, I can't believe she did this to me, boo, 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 boo. Bitch, I can't. I told you. We all tried to tell you. You a dumb motherfucker. She's stupid. <laughs> like a blue fish. Like a blue fish grand. Damn. Not 15, honey. Nigga, 15 grand. Exactly. <laughs> like, you a dumbass nigga. Man, he's the dumbest motherfucker on earth. You ain't got a whip or nothing. I would have at least did that. Man, so this blow, nigga, <laughs> he blew, he blew from 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 Michigan all the way to Nevada, and then we was in Nevada for like maybe a week, and then we went to California. Um, he really didn't spend too much in California because I brought his food for him in California. So yeah, he spent all he blew all his shit on them them two chicks in Nevada. Yeah, nigga dumb. Dumb as fuck. <laughs> what about the blue fifteen on no bitch? Especially if she ain't my bitch. Them went them went his bitches. Then his goofy ass gonna say, Cause so, you could go ahead, you go ahead and leave without me. Bitch, if you don't bring your motherfucking ass about this motherfucking chick house, I'm going to call 911. Leave without you. Right, I'm like, excuse me. I said, bitch, if you don't bring your ass out this, this chick motherfucking house, I'm going to dial 911, bitch. And I'm going to say it's a hostage thing going on because uh, you, I'm not playing with you. Bring your stupid ass on about this bitch house. It's like, fuck you mean, nigga. I'm about to leave without him. Man, that nigga got the motherfucking car. I said, what the fuck was you thinking? I said, you jumping out the motherfucking windows now? I said, why the fuck your black ass couldn't use the door? I said, because you ain't supposed to be in her house, huh? He talking about, no, I could be in there. I just didn't want to wake up her people. I said, nigga, what? Nigga, what? No, that ain't. I thought it didn't make no sense. It don't. Nigga, what? What you walking out their house is going to wake them up? How? How? Exactly. How? Bitch, if that's the case, I done already walked their ass up because I was beating on they motherfucking door like I was the FBI. Nigga, ringing the bell and everything. I was kicking that bitch. Boo, 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 boo. Bitch, I know my cousin in here. I got the location. Get two of the back end. <coughs> Shit. Cigarettes in the back end. Yeah. Back to high ends. Hip yeah, breath.
already. Twenty minutes already. God, is that Carlito? <laughs> I'm about to do that shit. See, I'm about to be jumping out of the kitchen with her. Don't you be doing that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you be yeah, doing that shit. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that shit. That shit is embarrassing. I don't love my fucking life. Fuck you. Talk about I don't love my fucking life. Yeah, don't do that shit. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> no, hell no, I ain't even. If a bitch can't have no company, I ain't going to her shit. And then it make me think, how old was this bitch? If but you that's what her. I said. I said, so how old is this chick for real? For real? I think he said she was like 23 or some shit like that, or 22 or some shit. But she's Mexican. Bro, they the Mexicans don't play down there, bro. You you black as black as this motherfucker is. You fucking on their daughter and shit. They ain't gonna kill your stupid ass. Oh, yeah. They should have never been up in their house. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know, man. That nigga. That nigga Ramsey was mad. <laughs> Like I said, shit, his pops came and was asking us, did we talk to him and shit? I'm like, no, I talked to him like a, probably like a few days ago, like when I was telling him about when Dog died. But that was weeks later, that was weeks after though. Oh, uh, see? Hey man, what the fuck see? are they doing, dog? They need to stop playing like that. They damn near almost ran Sharky and Carly Doe over. Ooh, oh, you talking about niggas at the water? <laughs> <coughs> the wash is closed. They walking down the street. They crossing the street. <coughs> and this motherfucker van damn near almost kabooted the fuck out of them. Oh, you know who that is? I know who that is. That, that nigga play too much. For him to be as old as he is, that nigga play too fucking much. Man, he dumb. <laughs> it's weird ass, but now I want to rain when I come out there. Man, what? It was just throwing down. <laughs> it was raining over there, buddy? Yeah. Coming down the live, but not really. Yeah, it's supposed to be. My mama sent me this, uh, this, uh, this shit off the website, the state of Michigan's website and shit. <clears throat> uh, the uh, the state of uh, I mean uh, Detroit uh, website and shit saying that we got severe storms and shit headed our way and whatnot. Oh, yeah. I said, uh oh, niggas about to get some more FEMA money again. Cause we I guess we supposed to get flooded and some shit. I don't know. I hope not. <clears throat> I it's sad, man. You know it's gonna flood some. It's all it always floods. I hope What's my up? crib don't get flooded though. Like, uh uh. I hope my shit don't get flooded. It's fucking chilly outside. What if we have a rainy ass summer? <laughs> Niggas gonna be mad. <laughs> <laughs> so much shit gonna be canceled. I'm gonna leave. I'm straight going to the West Coast. Like fuck this. Like you said, so much shit go. It ain't they ain't even gonna try to cancel it because you got some of them white folks that'll come out in the motherfucking rain downtown. 
like the hold down of the techno fest. <laughs> that shit still gonna be pumping and shit. <laughs> they ain't gonna have a big outcome though. I don't know why Carlito just opened that car wash up. <clears throat> Frank must be on their head. <laughs> uh -huh. Are they closed? They, they, no, the motherfucker was just closed. Carlito just went over there and opened that bitch up. I don't know why he went over there and opened that motherfucker up. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, what is it? Why would he go over there and open that bitch up? He could have stayed at home. It's gonna be. It's, it's headed you on the west. That shit always starts yeah. on the west. On the west and then head east. Yeah. It ain't coming out hard yet, but it's coming though. Hopefully, I can make it to the crib before this. <laughs> this motherfucker wanna go running and shit. These white people be killing me. I'm telling you, the white people fuck with this shit. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many weird people over here now. It's crazy. <laughs> more, more weird people when I. It, it's more. There's so many weird people. These niggas walk around like zombies over here. That's that shelter probably though. They can, that's probably what it is. They need to keep that shit on Kerchival. <laughs> Red, I mean, them shelter niggas, some of them be coming from Kerchival, walking up and down, jumping shit. Don't come on my side. Keep that shit up there on Kerchival. These niggas, that gas station open up there now. They can keep that shit over there. Don't come over here with that zombie looking yeah. shit. <laughs> I think they really, they really come on just to fuck material. Yeah, they keep that shit and go to Perry to go straight back across. Don't, don't come on the water side with that shit. Dude. That's I be looking yeah. shit. It's embarrassing. That, ah, damn. That's why it's so, I cause I be seeing that shit too. Like, shit. <laughs> I ain't never too. seen these niggas, but then again, these niggas gotta be from the shelter, like, cause the way they be looking. Y'all don't look like no homeowners uh, or none of that shit. Who is that? Hold on. Oh, my Lord and Jesus Christ. Is that little... Is that Eddie? This nigga was about to get fucking T-boned like a bitch on Jefferson. Oh, my God. Bro, I'm going to have to take that nigga driver's license from him at this point. Here comes this pedophile-ass nigga walking down the street. He's embarrassing, too. Which one? Goody? No, uh, Carl. <laughs> Goody, Carl, the one that got the shelter, the, the church. Nigga. What yeah. the fuck? That nigga, the, oh yeah, you did tell me that nigga was on the list. <laughs> Man, there's so many pedophiles around here, it make no sense. I was talking about Carl old drunk ass. <laughs> I did not know that nigga to touch him. I still couldn't find his why, shit though. Why is this nigga <laughs> walking down the street at twelve o'clock in the afternoon, damn near about to fall over? This it's too it's it's still too early to be that fucked up, man. No, that nigga be fucked up. No cap. Mm. All he drink is fucking uh what the fuck do he drink? Hmm. I think he drinks steer reserve some shit. Like that. <laughs> that nigga a crackhead. <laughs> oh my some god. Cheap, some cheap shit that will put you on your ass. Steel reserve? Steel reserve yeah. and four loco. They definitely put you on your motherfucker. You just need two kids of them motherfuckers. <laughs> you talking about one for one me. <laughs> one for me. This nigga drinks steer reserve. He's a crackhead. <laughs> I think so though. I don't really, I ain't sure, but I think so. I bought him a beer before, but I forgot what kind it was. I know he drinks some cheap shit though. <laughs> hey, that cheap shit really be putting motherfuckers on their ass. 
that's some shit. When we was at Perry's the other motherfucking day and shit, we all had walked down there and shit, and Joy was with us. This nigga Joy gonna pick up some shit off the motherfucking bottle. He picked up a bottle that was in the aisle. He talking about, hey, he was like, so-and-so came over with this shit, man. He took a sip of that shit. That shit was disgusting. I say, bitch, I don't drink nothing from down these aisles right here. Like, what the fuck was you thinking for no. even taking a sip of that shit? Look at the bottle. Why would you want to drink some of that shit? What the fuck? I can't even remember what that shit was called. But that ain't some shit that I fuck with. <laughs> that ain't no shit I fuck with. You crazy as shit. <clears throat> oh man, this nigga to put the tip box out there. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think that bitch about to do, son? Wait till that rain come that way. You it's already it. starting to push. It's already starting to push that way. It's clearing up over here now. You can feel. You can feel still, that shit, bro. Like it's still raining though. That's the thing. But not hard though. You will hear that shit if it's raining hard. If I'm outside. <laughs> You can feel, you can feel that it's about to throw that. You look at the sky <laughs> behind me on the side, like you could, you can tell it's about to fucking throw down, like, or it's about to do. I mean, I don't, I don't know why he opened that bitch up. They said it's supposed to storm. I know. That's what I'm saying. If it's supposed to storm, what the fuck you open it up for? <laughs> It wasn't open this morning. I don't know why he opened this bitch up right now. Like, I would have never opened this bitch up. That nigga, look, he looked like he just woke up. I, I would have turned the fuck back over like, you yeah, know. I'm not about to, I'm not about to go up there and open that motherfucker up for what? Ain't nobody about to make no money up there now unless they selling drugs. <clears throat> and Frank be on their head, so I know they ain't selling drugs. <laughs> That's why I'm about to take my ass on. Uh, no can do. I'm about to see that no light. Huh? That shit popping right now, huh? Shit. I'm not even about to door dash in this shit. Got a ear infection. What I need to be doing is going to the doctor. So you just got an ear infection? Again. <clears throat> I'm about to just let them go ahead and put these tubes in my ears. Put some tubes. <laughs> yeah. So that shit can drain. That shit. Oh. Yeah. And that Mercedes clean as hell. Look at them. They want to dig up some more shit on Jefferson. Jesus. We just can't cut your break up on Jefferson. Yeah, that motherfucker's fixing everything over there. I'm going to see how they fixing it. They dig every goddamn summer. The same. <laughs> be like the same spots and shit. Like, what the fuck? So did y'all not fix it last summer? What y'all do? Y'all was just checking on it? <laughs> I'm so confused. These motherfuckers always want to dig. I'm going to need the water company to come dig up some shit. <clears throat> FEMA talking about send me all your bills. I said, y'all want to pay my bills? <laughs> okay. <laughs> shit. More money in my pocket. offered to pay my bills before so shit hell yeah i just don't know i don't understand these motherfuckers the way they drive why would you asshole man you been on the game
most of the game since. I think I'm about to say, I think since. I play Call of Duty since the last time we played. I've been playing that LA. LA that LA North? That LA North. Man, me and my ex wife beat that whole game in three days. We literally sat there all day, all night playing the fucking game. <laughs> And then she would like go to sleep, I'll be up playing the game. Then I'll go to sleep, she'd be up playing the game and shit. <laughs> I didn't know that shit was like, was, was like. Hey, that's a good game. They need to come out with another one. Yeah, like I didn't know it was like that though. Yeah. <laughs> I should go download that shit, play it again. I'm like, I'm like, I got that shit. Let me see. When you say something like that, I got that shit. Hey, when you download it again, did it uh, start you off from where you left off at, or you had to redo the whole thing? Yeah. Oh, uh, it started from where I left off. Oh, uh, yeah. See, that's that good shit. Yeah, or you could redo the whole thing if you want. Yeah, I wouldn't. <laughs> well, it depends on how far you had gotten. If you didn't get that I, I far, I'd have been like, fuck I you. ain't that far. I ain't that far. I ain't got probably like. Yeah, he was probably. I was solving. Because you know, you. Turned into probably like five different types of detectives and shit. Then you do traffic was the first one. Then you do domestic violence cases and other cases. And then the murder solving okay. case. It's like five different detectives you gotta become before you beat that bitch. Shit, go Yeah, that game is that game is dope. They need to come out with a new one though. Saints Row. I was thinking about getting that shit. I used to have it. I got Saints Row. I got the last one they did. I got all of Saints Row. Like from Xbox 360 and shit. Like I got all them bitches still. Cause I still got my Xbox 360. <clears throat> And I be all them bitches, just like I be all the Grand Theft Autos. Saints Row than in this Grand Theft Auto, but it might be, it might be the same. They might probably got the same amount. I don't know. I gotta, I gotta look that shit up. Like they, they got, they got, I know, I know all the GTA. They got Grand Theft Auto, the regular one, GTA 2, 3. Then they got that San Andreas with the black nigga. Then they got that Vice City. Or uh, what else? Vice, Vice City one. came out, uh. I think before the San Andreas. Vice City came out first. Yeah. Then San Andreas came out. Then that Chinatown bullshit, that shit was weak as hell. Then they had that. Uh, so this nigga, um, Dennis been by here, and he put all this bullshit in my front yard. Because I was about to be like, now who in the fuck came by here and put all this bullshit? But that, this nigga Dennis, bro, Dennis can't forget it. Uh, motherfucking Brandon coming over to put a motherfucking metal roof on my shit. He can totally fucking forget it. You just need to charge this phone up. This shit just straight ended the car. <clears throat> Your long head ass hanging up the phone and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Damn you press the sometimes. Oh yeah, that bitch hang up and shit. Your phone rude. <laughs> 
that nigga came over here and dropped all this shit down in my yard and shit. Like, bro, what? I had to cut my grass. I should go get Joey. Like, you want to cut my grass? <laughs> he gonna be like, nigga, you want to cut my grass? No, but I'll let you use the lawnmower <laughs> so you can cut your grass. <laughs> Drop all this shit down in front of my house. Man, it's about to throw down. It's like it's about. It looked like it's about eight forty-five or some shit. Like it's getting dark. <laughs> right. I don't know what the fuck I was doing. It, so it do. That's because of how it look outside. That's why. It's one of them days where you just stay in and cuddle. Chill. Yeah. Nigga, like, I'm talking about cuddle. <laughs> My old punk ass little brother over there in motherfucking New York and see, he talking about, you know, you a certified lover boy. You're a certified lover boy. I don't know. I don't know what be wrong with these chicks or why they just can't do you right. Because you love them. You love them. I'm like, boy, if you don't shut your. You a certified lover boy, motherfucker. You got me fucked up, nigga. He talking, but I'm saying though, I'm like, you, you're childish. <laughs> you're fucking childish. You're never gonna grow up, AJ. <laughs> How the fuck are you in the Air Force and you're still childish? <laughs> he talking about what? What I'm saying? This nigga is, is bad. You know that is my son. <laughs> I raised that little nigga. I'm proud of him, but that nigga is bad. This nigga, this nigga got the nutting up. <laughs> He got the nutting up on this one cat. I, was, I keep saying New York. He ain't in New York no more. He in Buffalo. But um, he nutted up on this one cat. Because he ain't. Like him and his baby mama, they ain't they ain't together for real, for real and whatnot. But they had a joint account. One of their accounts was joint. But he's like, they both stopped using this shit. So when he went out of town, he said he partying and shit one night, right? He had the club. He partying and shit. And then he just, he got a, a, a alert on his phone that... You know, three bands was deposited into that account. So he like, hold on, what the fuck? So he said he went to the ATM, took that shit off. He said he went back to partying and shit. He talking about I was spending that money. The next thing you know, he like my baby mama called me. She got to tripping, talking about that was my money, this and that, whoopty whoop. And he was like, he was like, fuck is you talking about? He and he like, he said he ain't think nothing of it. He like, I ain't think he's like, I just he was like, I thought the bank just made a mistake or some shit or somebody just gave somebody the wrong account number by that number off or some shit and that shit landing up in my shit he's like so you know i'm gonna do what every nigga do i'm gonna just take all that shit off <laughs> so he took all the money i took oh bro because <laughs> that's the shit i would have did i'd be like oh somebody made a mistake let me uh but i would have did something better i would have closed the whole account after i took all that money out closed the account bow that shit can't fall back on me or none of that shit you feel me so he just, wow, he so he said he went back to partying and shit. He like, nigga, he was like, I ain't even had to touch my money. Not like shit, because somebody gave me some free money. He was like, now I ain't think, you know, she had somebody send some money over into that account. And then like, he like, I ain't no thief. Like, no, none of that. He was like, I was about to get the money back. He was like, but then the dude texted me with my social security number. I was like, oh, yeah, nope. 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 Boy, that nigga, AJ, that nigga got to, he got to nothing up. <laughs> that nigga went back to Buffalo. He like, so what you want to do? Nigga, <laughs> he was like, he was like, because he like, I might like, so your baby mama gave this nigga, this, this nigga that you do not know, your fucking social security number. He was like, yeah, he's like, that's what I'm trying to tell you. I'm looking like, no, bro, no, no. I'd, I'd, I was like, bro, she have had to get her ass beat, too. He was like, I was, but then everybody was like, that's your baby mama, whoop de woo Because he said, this nigga dumb, he just said, you know, this is my little brother. This nigga dumb, he said he was about to go to the high school and get three big bitches and pay them $100 each to beat her ass every fucking day they get out of school, go over there and beat that bitch ass. $100 each every day. He said he was about to do that shit, but motherfuckers talking about like, that's your baby, <laughs> that's your baby mama and his man. So him and his boys... They on that nigga head. That nigga apologized. It was like, hey, look, I don't want no smoke. Because they was, was like, that nigga AJ, with his voice was literally on this nigga head. To where this nigga got scared and shit. Like, 
that nigga copping please and shit now. Like, hey, look, I don't want no smoke. You keep the money, all that shit. You feel me? I'm looking like hell. Now, you just bullied a nigga out of three three bands, bro. <laughs> you pretty much just bullied a nigga out of three bands. Well, that's, that's his fault because AJ said he was about to give the money back to his baby mama. And then this whole ass nigga had to intervene. He had to intervene or whatnot and text AJ his own social security number. So that's what made him snap. That would have made me snap too. Like, oh, hold on. Wait a minute. Hold the fuck on. Nah. See, oh, we playing these kind of games. All right. Watch this. So, yeah. Homeboy, he played himself. Because <clears throat> instead of just letting his uh, AJ baby mama handle him, he wanted to jump in. Like, he was tough and shit. That's why I be telling motherfuckers, ain't got shit to do with you. Stay out of it. Yeah, that was your money. You sent it to her. So therefore, she got to fight and figure out how to get that money back from her baby daddy. That shit ain't got nothing to do with you. Because if it was me, I'd have been like, well, shit, I don't know what you want me to tell you. I sent you the money like you asked, like I said I was going to do. You let another nigga take that shit from you, so you got to figure that shit out. <clears throat> ain't got nothing to do with me. Why would you have me send some money to an account where y'all both... Is on that bitch anyways. So. Don't the motherfuckers. Homeboy could have lost his life out there. Motherfucking Buffalo. <laughs> Fucking around my brother. Like. Brother ain't no. He, he supposed to be. Um, coming. He's supposed to be on his way here. In a couple motherfucking days and shit. This nigga. Um, time by I need some weed. I'm like well how much. Then time by the Hey, want some pounds? Okay. You gotta tell me how much you trying to spend though. Shit. Yeah. yeah, he's a little bad. As you know, he in the Air Force, so they get that. You can get that shit off in the Air Force. Told him, like, nigga, just go rally up everybody chicken. How much they want. Whatever I'm charging you, you charge them a little bit more. <clears throat> shit. Come get your shit. But how you gonna get that shit back to Buffalo? I'm not gonna let you drive. I'm not about to let him drive with that shit. Like, nigga, what? Not about to drive with that shit. Unless you got somebody else that take that risk, man. He better. <laughs> he better. He better not be nowhere near that motherfucking vehicle. I mean, that nigga grown, but that nigga got a whole career. It's my trophy. All my kids was raised right. He's like, hey, you remember when I fucked that bitch at your loft? This <laughs> 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 nigga, he talking about, remember I fucked it with the plastic bag? <laughs> you said what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Bro, I was just like, <laughs> nigga, childish. <laughs> yeah, he was only like 15. I think he was like 15, 14, 15. With the plastic bag. I said, you embarrassing? <laughs> so embarrassing. Yeah, because him and my other brother, uh, KJ, my ex-wife uh, brother, they was fucking on this little bitch down the hall. <laughs> and shit. And they neither one of them dumb motherfuckers had a kind. I said, why y'all just didn't ask? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Dirty dick ass niggas. Dirty dick ass niggas. Both of them <laughs> dirty dick ass niggas. I'm like, y'all niggas. Y'all embarrassing. <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> Both of them fucking that little girl that all is it. <laughs> I say, man, this bitch is terrible. She's gonna be through when she get older, bro. Cause they was like, I think they was like. 
Yeah, they was like 14, 15. I think KJ probably was like 16. <clears throat> Yeah. Sure. <laughs> hey man, those are the days. I'm pretty much talking about a bag. You rock dog the bitch. You might as well not use even the bag, nigga. I don't know what you was thinking. You thought that was protection? That shit didn't hurt. <laughs> I'll get cracked up with the bag. <laughs> Thinking, oh, I'm thinking he put the bag over her head. No. <laughs> you stupid. Oh, my God. You talking about I'm thinking he put the bag over her head. Oh, my God. You, that's They was trying to kill the bitch, huh? Put the bag over her bitch head. <laughs> <laughs> like, Bro, that's what I say. Like, that shit didn't hurt. It should have hurt it for her and for him. Like what? They cracked the bitch on the stairs at the loft. I said, oh my gosh, all right.